Hello everyone, hope you're keeping well. Oh, it's a chilly, chilly Broadland today. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So I'm here at um, Rollsby Broad, which is one of the Trinity Broads, which is a short drive away from my home. So um, you can probably hear the, um, the road behind me, unfortunately. The trouble is with this, um, this location is you've got a road dividing two absolutely gorgeous broads. And we're very limited for shooting opportunities from here, but I couldn't resist stopping here this morning because um, the broads are partially frozen, which is wonderful. And it's a beautiful, beautiful morning. It's particular, um, excuse me, particularly clear. So that means we'll get some nice light come through and go onto the reeds. Um, so yeah, very, very nice. What a, what a lovely morning, very fresh, very fresh. So um, I've already taken a couple of pictures with the 2470 of a general scene. And what I'm also gonna do now is I'm just gonna point the 135, the 135 is on ready. And I'm gonna zoom into, where's my little finger? That area there, there is a beautiful little um, shape in the, in the ice there. So I'm just gonna take that with a, with a longer lens. Uh, hopefully that's quite effective. I'll put up a bit of video to show what I'm, um, what I'm doing there. But all in all, lovely morning. What I might do today, guys, is, is do a little half an hour stint here, getting the sort of the first light and the twilight light, and then I'll perhaps move on somewhere else. But who knows? Who knows what, 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 um, what will happen with the plans? But very nice, beautiful morning. So um, I'll put up my first like initial shots and um, video scenes, and then we'll, um, we'll see what we do from there. Yeah, what a lovely morning. Chilly. The initial twilight colours are sort of dissipated now, so it's a little bit more sort of even light and perhaps even, <coughs> excuse me, what you could say, a little bit dull at the moment, but what I'm waiting for is obviously the sun to come up and put some lovely light in the distance on those reeds. Quite happy with that shot with the um, little bit of ice. That looks really good. I'm looking for, you know, this, this area here, those reeds all to be lit up. I think the reeds during the winter when they've got light on them take such beautiful color and look so good. So that will be nice when that's, when that's ready to rock and roll. So we'll all, excuse me, <clears throat> my words this morning, I'm not quite with it. Um, so all I'm doing is waiting for the, um, waiting for the light to come, to come through. Beautiful, yeah, just trying to keep warm and um, not kick the camera into the broads. <laughs> Oh, it's lovely. Actually, it's one of those days where I wish I had a slightly longer lens. But there we go, never mind. One of those things. Anyway, yeah, gorgeous, gorgeous. Anyway, back to in a minute when um, perhaps when we get some sunlight and um, should be some nice shots then. Okay. Oh, that sun's starting to come up. I've just seen another shot for later on. Look at these down here. Oh. That's really nice, really nice. Oh yeah, sun's starting to touch the trees. So what I've got to do here, guys, is I've got to sort of flip between two broads while crossing a rather busy road. It's gonna look, it's gonna look interesting. So yeah, now, hmm, yeah, starting to get some light there. Quite liking the look on the other side of the road. So I think this might be a cross the road job. And then back to this spot, all very complicated. Great fun, gonna get some funny looks, I suppose, walking across the road with a tripod and, um, Oh, hold on, just look behind me. Swans are coming in, they think I've got something for them. Um, no, I think I've had the Nature Valley bar yesterday in the car after a morning at, um, morning at Haysborough, so I'm sorry about that, Swans. Anyway, I think I'm gonna go and cross the road. Yeah, <laughs> great fun, great fun. Well, I just did my little trip to the other side of the road. Impossible to do audio that side, guys. The, the traffic is basically right beside you, so impossible. Some gorgeous light over there, gorgeous light. Think I got some nice stuff. 
Lovely to see the broad frozen. I haven't seen the broads frozen for quite a while, so that was really, really nice to see. So I've come back on to the other side, which is um, Rollsby Broadside, and um, some lovely light. Just, oh, I just wish I had that longer lens for those ice patterns with that lovely kink in it in the distance, but never mind. Might be able to do something with it. You know, at the end of the day, we've got so much, um, so many pixels now on the cameras, I might be able to do a sort of an abstract from it. Uh, not sure what else I can do this side, to tell you the truth. Now, I've got some lovely light. There's a beautiful little reed, um, reed sticking out. I'm not really describing that very well, am I? But I'll put it up. I'll, I'll, t I'll show you what I mean. <laughs> My brain is still engaging. Um, aside from that, yeah, I'll have a little quick look around, and if not, I'll try and move on somewhere. If not, this will be a very short vlog, but that doesn't matter. It probably doesn't matter to YouTube, but I don't give a monkeys, really, what YouTube think. I'm just putting out these videos because I like doing them. But I must go back and shoot the crunchy leaves. That's one thing I must do. Crunchy leaves down there, yeah. I mustn't forget them. I'm going to look really strange by the side of the road shooting crunchy leaves, but hey. I don't care. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna yes, just yeah, just stand here a little while, have a look round and see if there's anything else presents itself to me. If not, I'll um, if not, I'll move along or call it quits. But for the moment, hopefully there'll be some more images after this. <laughs> Okay, well, I've stood around and yeah, abstracts have come to me. Abstracts have appeared before my eyes. I'm shooting down here with all these lovely deposits of ice. There's that little pier there. Beautiful orangey reflections. Where's my finger? Orangey reflections in the water. The light on the reeds in the distance. All these combined, maybe using this bit of ice. Just some abstracts. Just some abstracts taken with them. It's really good stuff, good practice. Sorry about my finger coming into the frame. Lovely. There's a lovely kink in the ice there as well. A new one I've just seen, apart from the one I was shooting earlier. Oh, that would be lovely. Maybe I can do that on a crop and see if I can shoot that. That looks good. But yeah, so I'm just looking for abstracts in here. Once again, apologies for that. That's my finger. And um, I'll put those up in a minute. Yeah. Lovely. Still in the same place. This time, water. Now, I don't know whether you guys are familiar with a wonderful photographer named Mike Curry. Now, his shots of water, reflections, are amazing. So look it up, Mike Curry. Mike Curry, look at his wonderful water images. They are stunning. So I am doing my best to replicate Mike's work and probably doing an incredibly bad job, but it's just wonderful to watch. It's so hypnot hypnotic. I probably, in all honesty, I probably enjoy the video of it more than the actual still images. You know, um, yeah, beautiful. But um, I'll put up a few water abstracts and um, see if they work. It's worth a go, isn't it? Something to do, keeps me off the streets. <laughs> that sounded wrong. <laughs> anyway, yeah, put these up, see what they look like. Hey, here I am at Ashness Jetty. I've just had a quick trip to the Lake District. <laughs> now, this is like the um, Norfolk version of Ashness Jetty. Can I even say Ashness Jetty? Yes, I can. Yeah. Wonderful. 
absolutely love it. No, I'm not taking the cliche down the jetty shop. No, I might do, why not? I'm here. But I'm just gonna take a few more of these wonderful, I've become quite obsession with these water things now. <laughs> They were, yeah, I rather like those. But yeah, I'm just, there's a lovely area of ice there as you can probably see in the distance if I get my hand to go the right way. Yeah, maybe use the, the little fishing pier, a little bit of an abstract there with the ice, rather nice. Also, there's some lovely bird, um, bird footprints in there on the, um, on the boardwalk here. So I might even take some abstracts there. So it's become, yes, it's become abstract time. But hey, that's brilliant. As far as I'm concerned, that is absolutely marvelous. Light is still gorgeous. I'm freezing. My hands are effing freezing. And um, I'm just, actually, I'm having an absolute whale of a time. It's been a brilliant week, guys. Do you know, I've been out every morning, five days in a row, or five mornings in a row, and I've really enjoyed myself. I've, I think I've even, done a vlog most days and I'm just really back in the saddle enjoying my photography and um yeah it's great just really great so there'll be more abstracts to put up here I think and um yeah I carry on yeah and I've still got to go back and shoot the crunchy leaves yet so um I hope I don't miss them I don't think I'll forget them um, yeah, so I'll put up some stuff from around here and see what it's all like. Incidentally, guys, what I'm doing is I'm doing a lot of focus shift um, shooting, which is really, really handy, of course. Just set that, um, set those increments correctly and you've got a beautiful front to back um, abstract image. Um, I have, today I have been avoiding doing my 1.8 selective focus, avoided it today. I thought, not today. Do not do that today, John. So I haven't. I don't think I've shot anything at 1.8. Just a little bit of a different approach today. Right, okay, stop gassing, John, put some images up, yeah? Okay. <laughs> Great morning, loved it, absolutely loved it. Was gonna go on somewhere else, as I may have mentioned when I was speaking earlier. This has really entertained me, kept the eye in, kept me thinking, giving me a little bit of a, another boost from my photography at the moment. So, so pleased with what I'm doing at the moment. And um, yeah, it's great. So I hope you enjoy the, um, the abstracts. Oh, I can just sit, oh, gotta stop looking at that pier it's just yeah just a lovely shape with the with the frost on it and the curve of the ice fantastic so i'm going to walk back to the car now i uh, haven't got a flask with me today so but i'm only 10 minutes from home so that's nice have a nice coffee and bickies and i'm just going to shoot those leaves on the way hopefully <laughs> and um yeah it's been a great morning guys thanks ever so much for joining me in a very chilly broadland today i hope to see you soon and um look after yourselves take care Give each other a great big hug. Yeah. All right. Look after yourself. Bye-bye. See you later. Bye.